Over 2 million older people will spend Christmas alone this year, according to new statistics from Age UK. That is why Age UK, one of Britain's main age charities, has launched the campaign, quote, the hardest day of the year, unquote. This Christmas, we've launched our campaign, the hardest day of the year, because we know that for many, many people at uh, this time, uh, Christmas is that hardest day. In fact, well over two and a half million people said the one thing they wanted for Christmas this year was companionship. We hope that as a result of the hardest day campaign, people will stop and think for a minute. Think about the older person in their lives, maybe living down their street or a relative that they haven't seen for some time, and um, pick up the phone and make arrangements for, uh, for, for that older person to be with them for this Christmas. Britain is not the only country where Christmas will be a lonely affair for many elderly people. They are often forgotten and left out of major celebrations because of ageist attitudes, which are believed to be held by half the world's people, according to a United Nations report. VOA spoke with some seniors in London to hear what they think. We class at the moment as like a second class citizen. That's exactly what we are. Ageism, it's all, the young disregard the old, I find. But it's probably not just here, it's probably in other countries as well. And uh, it's a shame because uh, we should understand each other better because the young will be old one day. For Umberto Aguiar in London, Elizabeth Cherneff, VOA News.